never situated. I'll tell you what. I'm trying. I'm like, I, I think I'm a minute late. Sorry, guys. Oh, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. I'm trying to get you guys a little bit closer. Ooh, I got notified. Who got notified? I never get notified. Hold on. So we're going to do our typical doohickey where I go over here and I let people know. Y'all girl is on line. Hey, Melissa. Hey, Stacy. Hey, Gina. Melissa's here. Whoop, whoop. I got Stacy and Gina. I'm so, you guys got on quick. Did you? Okay, hold on. I got a, I got a, hmm. That dog on multitasking. Sorry, guys. I didn't full face today. I put like mascara on <laughs> and eyebrows. Hey, Holly. Hi, Danielle and Joyce. Oh, I feel like I did it again. Uh, okay, I'm trying to put on Facebook. Is it Yeska? Yeska? Did I say it right? Laura's here. We have pineapple. We have... Oh, excuse me. I wasn't talking to you. Sorry, apparently. Oh, thank you. Okay, let me go in here. I am so sorry, guys. We are live. Let's put the link. Is it in a show? Hey, Ashley, finding live. Hello. Okay. Okay. And I did it. Hmm. Now I'm focusing back on you guys. Don't forget to hit that like button. Yes, yes. Hold on. Let me get on here. Yeah. Let me hold on, Stacy. I'm clicking the doohickey. Boom. There we go. All right. <laughs> so how's y'all's weekend? I um I was I it was so funny. I was gonna be productive. Hey Tina. Hey makeup junkie. And I told my husband this morning, I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna make bullet points. I'm gonna like stay on point. Jokes on me. Guess what? I didn't do. I did not do that. I did not. Oh yeah. Let's see how many like likes we can get, guys, because I forget about that. And I think I heard that. If you, you can get like thumbs up, YouTube likes and stuff, that YouTube will actually let people know you're on. So um, if you guys could hit that like button, I would greatly appreciate it because, yay. <laughs> Thank you, Danielle. Okay, guys, so um, did you guys happen to see Sephora posted all of their holiday sets today? Oh, girl, Stacey, you know your girl's going to ramble because... I was gonna try. I literally was gonna try so hard to have like bullet points and I was like this is gonna be like so what's the word professional <laughs> jokes on me I probably have peanuts in my teeth because I was eating some peanuts right before I got on like mixed nuts and all that hey Angela so yay you know, right? I know, my husband, well, okay, so the kids are out, like, doing their own thing right now, and so, and the husband is up in his, like, in his little space doing his little thing, and so, like, I don't have to get nervous, because you guys know, like, if the husband is around, I get, like, goofy. I get so crazy goofy, and I keep watching every self to make sure he doesn't, like, pop on here, because <laughs> sometimes he does that, and I'm like, oh. <laughs> Oh, man. I Right, Angela? Bullet points are really not my thing. Like, I, I thought it would be, like, really good and structured. But then I'm like, I, when I was talking to my husband about it today, I was like, you know what, though? I like, like, seeing what you guys write and, like, trying to respond to everybody. But I thought, like, the bullet points might be nice because when I'm trying to respond to everybody, I completely jump off topic and so my ADHD like goes even it looks even more insane when I try and watch a playback I'm like Lord Jesus how does anybody ever sit and watch these videos you know <laughs> so I do like watching football actually we had we used to like when my husband and I first got together we used to Sunday was like mass football day up in the house like we would make all kinds of snacks and all kinds of stuff and I was like hardcore into it and then all the drama happened with it, and, sorry, I got a hair in my mouth. And then we just don't do it as much anymore, like watching football. Um, I don't think I'd relate to you as much if you were for <laughs> Catherine. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> I'm not. Like, and that's the one thing. It was so funny. I was watching um, YouTube today, and someone had said something about, you know, she talked about being nervous when she goes live, you know, because you kind of have to think about what you say, 
And I told my husband, I'm like, I'm the exact same way. Like, at least when I'm like making content for you guys, hey, Jen, I was just finishing up your video. <laughs> and then I'm like, oh crap, I gotta go live. <laughs> <laughs> your look was beautiful by the way but yeah I was sitting there and I was like oh like at least when I'm filming content I can edit out when I like start pinging off into like 50 different directions and then sometimes as you guys know I just upload a video and I'm like <laughs> hope for the best because she was all over the place but when I go live I'm like oh goodness you just never know what's gonna fall out of my mouth let me go back and read some Thanks for the C color recommendations. I'm getting ready to place another order. The Safari Dude and the Clover. Oh, thank you so much, Angela. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stacey, you're so good at this. Yes, if you guys could, please give me a thumbs up because that would really help our channel. Like, in my head, I think it'll help it grow. If you guys know, like, tips and tricks, let your girl know. I'd appreciate it. I'm in the same room with football, but <laughs> see, I, Tina, like I said, we used to be so into it and now neither one of us, like it was funny, we were laying in bed watching, or well, I was like watching YouTube and then he was on his laptop and he had pulled football up and I said, babe, you could just put it on the TV. He's like, I don't know if I really want to get that invested into it. You know, we're just, it's one of those things. I found a new desert place, maybe we can go gluten <laughs> yes there's keto around here that's the one thing I wish like I hear I've seen like vlogs where people talk about going to I think is it San Diego I think it's San Diego and they say everything is like gluten-free and keto and like healthy and I'm like I think that would be fun okay sorry I'm going back <laughs> oh no finding life I, I figured out what you meant I was like Lido keto mm. hey gothic girl does anyone know what the new alter ego I know right Gina I posted that on my Instagram they're like given the teaser I don't have it place another order thanks to Rhonda oh thank you all my sisters am I saying your name right is it Yeska I don't know. Cheesecake, cake, pies. Oh my gosh. Fun in life. That sounds amazing. Laura, I am actually having like this weekend, like I thought for sure yesterday. Oh yeah, I totally forgot about that. Stacy, please share too. Like and share. I would love that. We can get more of us. Um, I thought for sure I was going to be like not functioning well by nighttime because um, my daughter the night before had a birthday party to go to so I took her to that and um, I got invited to that Sephora did you guys see that vlog with Haley and I Haley and I went to that Sephora holiday event and yeah that and we had to leave early because it took us a bit to get there and so we left early we got there a little after and Anyways, we, uh, it, it was, you know what, though, the highlight of it was Bath and Body Works had the, the wallflowers on sale, so we loved that. If you guys have never tried wallflowers, they're pretty awesome. Like, I hadn't tried them since they came out, like, back in whenever, and I never got them again, and then they had them on sale, so I picked one up for the foyer, and I was like, oh my gosh, this smells delicious in here, and then, um... I had to take my youngest back because they did pottery, so we had to drive all the way back out there. And while I was out there, I picked up a bunch of wallflowers. They were like $2 and change. Sorry, guys. I start my tangenting, and then I miss all y'all's talking. Oh, my gosh. Gina, did you get the 5 for 25 lip liners at Gerard Cosmetics? Jen, that deal was amazing. And I picked up five of the sugar and spice. <laughs> I'm waiting my sugar and spice to show up because <laughs> I'm like... I could totally just go ahead and pick up like five different shades, but I am like so routine in my regimens and sugar and spice is totally my jam. So yeah, I picked up five. <laughs> so I'm waiting on them. <laughs> oh goodness. My husband says I'm not allowed to watch your Is It A Duke videos anymore. <laughs> Tia. Oh, I'm sorry, girl. <laughs> 
Oh my gosh. Okay. God forbid I silence anything. Uh oh, we got we got children home. Okay, hold on guys, I gotta go get the door. <sighs> okay, sorry. Hmm. See, we're not about the professional life over here, guys. This is mom life, real life. Okay, let me go back and read. <sighs> Soft that I do. Actually, it's right here. Actually, because I was playing with it yesterday. <laughs> I do have those palettes. And I have to say, I love these larger pans in here on those palettes. Because you get so much, and I use them all the time, and they're really cheap. They're like really good base base ones. Okay, sorry guys, I have to go back. You know what though? I don't think that I did Is It A Duper just to waste some money. I think I just reviewed these, to be honest with you guys. But they, I have a lot of stuff that, if it's like right in this circle, this is like my go-to section. Like complete go-to. So yeah, the moods are ups and downs. They are pineapple. I tell you, like I don't, I'm not on that. I'm on, like my, I, I do a functional medicine doctor is who I go to. And um, so mine is all like natural and all that stuff. But I'm not going to show you because it's embarrassing. If you guys have, if you have thyroid issues, you probably have that, that geographical tongue or whatever it's called. And... If you take extra zinc, it helps it. And it's so embarrassing because there's times that I'll be editing my video and I obviously, I'm like, la, 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 and I talk a whole bunch. And you can see, and I know that I'm having like, I call it like a flare up when my thyroid flares up. So if my tongue starts to get that roadmap on it, then I know my zinc has gotten low. Just, you know. Catherine, it's like, hold on, I don't want to hit. Okay. Uh, 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 mm. I don't want to show you, it's embarrassing. But, like, it looks like a flipping map on your tongue. And that's how I know, like, oh, you need more sleep, you need more zinc, you need the vitamin D, you need some Bs. So, yeah, your body's a really weird indicator of stuff that you need. So, just FYI if you have hypothyroidism. Okay, sorry, guys, I got to go back. I, I, like, missed a lot. I have a small session with Walter. Ashley. When they're $2 and change, you know your girl justified buying, I'm not even going to admit how many, but it was, I should be set for probably the next six months. Yeah. It's not good. But it, but the girl was really, really sweet and gave me a 20% off coupon too. I don't know. Actually, I have to say, if you guys live in like Cincinnati, Northern Kentucky, the Crestview Hills area so nice. Um, I had gone to that Sephora. They wouldn't let me film there, which I was kind of annoyed because I watched um, a holiday event on um, on YouTube today. Look, sorry guys, I'm I'm like ping right off to the next thing. But um, I don't. The girl wasn't. I don't think she was there by any means. But she was in a Sephora and she got. Well, they had a huge selection, but she filmed all kinds of stuff. Like not store per se but like the holiday things like you could see her pull them off the shelf and show y'all like what it was and I was like wow they wouldn't even let me whip out a camera there but the Bath and Body Works did and they were super super kind and she's like yeah it's free permission for us like yeah please do it and I was like okay so if you watch the vlog I have the camera out in the Bath and Body Works one they were so nice at that Bath and Body Works guys so nice. Okay, sorry. Going back. This is like the most all over the place live ever. I'm so sorry. My husband doesn't say much, Stephanie, about the wallflowers. I guess he just deals with it. Hey, Pamela from Vegas. Is it crazy hot out there? We've been having fake fall weather here. Today was actually decent. Okay. Gothic girl. <laughs> family channel I can't say that in case my nieces are on here um you know I hadn't been for the longest time like I have not wallflowered and like my candles are always my candle by Victoria's guys my melts are always candle by Victoria 
And I, I legitimately only picked it up because my daughter was like, Mom, these are so good. You got to try them. And I was like, okay. So I did. So, okay, let me go back. I'm so sorry. Oh, Gina, it stinks. It's not fun. It's not fun having hypothyroidism. here I love see color too I love how for you guys I'm working on a really cool video for you guys like if you saw Friday's video you already know um, finding a dupe for this I mean it's not gonna be a formula dupe but I've been working um, today like I don't know if you can still see swatches now I did pretty good getting it off but I'm so excited about that video so make sure you subscribe you guys we're at 25 likes I think that's the most we've ever done thank you Stacy for reminding everyone feel free to hit that thumbs up I know I have three that always are good at hitting that thumbs down but whatever you do you let's see here sorry I have to go back I love your channel. oh thank you Susan you start a new job tomorrow. That's exciting, Gina. You're in Mississippi. Oh, I bet it's hot. 38 on 21. Hit that button, friends. Yes, Frog Push. Thank you. Okay, I think am, am I, I I know I'm missing people. I'm so sorry, guys. Connie, I okay, here's the deal. And this this is something that so bugs me so much when companies see that um, people are loving stuff, so then they start hiking the price of stuff up. These are from Michaels, okay? And they're one, two, three, four, five. It's their five drawers is what it is. Oh, hey, Jen. Oh, welcome, welcome. So these are like their five drawers, okay? And so you literally could get these on sale for $39. Now I'm gonna tell you, all of a sudden, since people are we're calling them dupes for Ikea and everything, They've, I've seen them as high as almost a hundred flipping dollars. That's not what I paid. I literally paid $39.99. I used Ebates and a coupon. No, you couldn't use a coupon. You could only use Ebates. So I got them and then my husband connected them for me. So that's why they're stacked. Like these are tall. I've got one, two, three, four, five. I have six of them. And yeah, these two that you guys can always see in the background, those are stacked on other ones. So keep an eye out on Michaels, but I even noticed with their carts, which you guys can't see the cart, but those clear carts that they have that all the teachers love to get, yeah, they hike the price of this. I just checked it because I was gonna um, link it for you guys. I'm working on my morning routine skincare video, which will either go up the end of this week or the following week, and they made them like $69. I'm like, I swear y'all, that's not what I paid. That is not what I paid. So, uh, oh, my perfumes. Right now, I keep these Joe Malone's, but there is a, your, is it Euphoria? It's thick. And then there's another one that I really like. I don't, I can't pronounce it. You guys know your girl, she's a mess. Oh, I'm not, I think that's way down south, right, Christine? Look at this, you guys, this doggone Pat McGrath stuff, I thought I got it all, and it is still, it's like dog hair, cat hair, it's everywhere. Oh, thank you, Seeking, I literally have, like, next to nothing fun, so I appreciate that, girl, <laughs> a lot. eBay, pineapple, are you, are you in the United States? Because I don't know if it's international, but... I can tell you it's called Rakuten now and you can shop online shop online and get money back it's good the lady is the reason I kept telling you to get C color cosmetics Tia <laughs> oh goodness um, hold on now I have my other child who is uh, facetiming me I, I'm live It's fine. They're upstairs. They were quiet. Love you. Bye. <laughs> I was like, I literally sent a text. I was like, hey, if you guys plan on coming in or anything, can you quietly do it? Because I'm going to be live. Oh. 
Yay, Jeannie made it in time. I just got Vanilla Vibe sample from Juliet. That's good. I, do I have any of them samples? I don't think I have, is that a newer scent? Cause I've heard of Juliet has a gun, but I've never heard of that one. Angela, I'm so sorry guys, I'm missing so many comments. I'm trying to go back. Yes, Angela, I every Sunday, 6.15 Eastern Standard Time, I like to get on here and just chat with you guys. Like I, I, I said in the beginning <laughs> that I thought I was going to make bullet points, but then I just get on and ramble. So it's like 45 minutes of Rhonda rambles and chatting with you guys. <laughs> ADD strong, friends. <laughs> You and Tara were good support for each other when she was wrecking you. Oh, I love Tara Lynn. She is such a sweetheart. She is such a sweetheart. And that Natasha Denona palette still hasn't even shown up. I'm so annoyed with them. I've like reached out to customer service, have not even heard back. So yeah. But I hear from what I've heard from people, like I'm not really missing out. So, you know, there's that. It was in my Sephora play. Was it? I, you know what? It was weird, Stephanie. We didn't get anything in our Sephora play perfume-wise last month. But we haven't gotten our mini Ipsy Biogs this month or our mini or, um, Sephora plays. We haven't gotten. Neither one of us have gotten those this month. Finding life. I'm in Buffalo. Finding life. Oh, you're jumping off. Okay, bye. Thank you for stopping by. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to go by and check Ugh. and I'm not a fast reader so then I get even more paranoid I'm now sweating profusely go me <laughs> cheese and grapes oh that sounds good I can't do grapes but cheese sounds amazing oh Jen I look organized uh, no, that's a no <laughs> I'm a Gemini <laughs> with ADHD girl <laughs> I mean okay so yeah, yes and no. Like, I'm kind of organized, but I'm also kind of chaotic. Like, I can't have too much clutter or I panic and freak out. It's just too much. Um, and actually, to be honest with you guys, my daughter Haley organized my drawers for me because I got overwhelmed because it became like a cluster and I was like, I can't, I can't, this is just too much. And Haley loves to do stuff like that. So that was right up her alley. Like she literally for, would be a great like thing for her to just go in and organize. Like, you know how Kim Kardashian apparently started off like that? Ashley, um, is the intent there to do that? Yes. Will it happen? <laughs> no. <laughs> Probably not. I think I'll probably do it for like a video because I've done it before for like that Dose of Color, uh, that one, bright one. And I, um, I wore it for that and then I took it off and then that wasn't, that was just enough. I just couldn't do it. But would I like to? I would. Sorry guys, I've got to go back. I'd be like, oh, I miss so much. Why do I miss it? I wonder if I pull it up on my phone, if I would be able to keep better track of um, comments. You think? I don't know. We could hope. One could hope. I'm trying. And like I said, the, the worst part of it is like I'm a slow reader. I needed an intervention. Tell me I don't need it. Jenny? Did you watch Emily Noel's video? Because I'm gonna tell you right now, I was like, I don't need that Naked Honey Urban Decay palette. I don't need that in my life. It's not gonna bring anything to me. And then Emily Noel came on my channel. And then I said, you know what? I, I may need that in my life. And then I was like, no, no, no. <laughs> so how much did you say your drawers were? Jen, um, $39.99 is what I paid and it's like a five. So each little set was $39.99. Oh, what am I missing? I see Stacy said Patreon. I do have a Patreon, you guys. If you guys are interested in the Patreon, there's, I don't know if it'll link. I'll have to probably come back and 
fill it all out in the description box for you guys. But yeah, I totally have a Patreon and I use my Patreon money to help support the content that I put out for you guys. Because I know I've had some people like, how did you get that Pat McGrath palette? And I'm like, girl, I got, plus I got Poshmark, so your girl hustles. <laughs> just joking, I don't. <laughs> I just fingers crossing it for the best. <laughs> Oh, Christine, you're so sweet. So that's where the Patreon must have come from. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I have a Patreon that, like I said, you guys get early access videos because of my Patreons. I have, That's why I have the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus video again. So they get early access to videos before you guys get to see videos. Let me go back. I gotta go back. I miss it so much. I love that you guys are interacting so much. Thank you so much. Pamela, I'm telling you, if you can catch these things on sale at Michael's, do it. Don't spend the extra money at Ikea. And I mean, they're not like, they don't slide as smoothly as um, the Ikea ones, but like, do you really need that? Because, you know? Oh, I don't know. Finding life. I don't, I mean, depends, because I try and make my own keto stuff occasionally. Occasionally. Are you having a small amount on Poshmark? Yes, I do believe I am. Let me just go check. I just put stuff up there. <laughs> Fingers crossed. I save that, man. I mean, that is like the best way to like get extra money. How do you pull up your account? Yeah, Rhonda, Hot Mess Mama MD. That's how I do it. There we go. I see a palette I really want. I just hope that. I know, Tia Maria. Same. Same. Because that honey palette, I'm like, you know, C Color has been good about duping some of the Urban Decay things. So that would be nice. A dessert date. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Is it local? Let's see. Oh, Seeing Knowledge 81. I do not have any of those palettes, and I would love to have some of those palettes. They look so pretty. I saw Angelica Nyquist. Uh, she reviewed some of them, and I was like, and honestly, I didn't even know that that company existed until I saw her reviews. And then I was like, that is gorgeous. I would like those in my life. BOMO is totally real, Frog Push. You know, Ashley, I will tell you, the Biba, it's just like such an easy palette. Like, I feel like you just don't have to, you, you don't have to think hard about it. Like, I was talking with Corey today about it, and it's always nice to have like, like those quick go-to palettes where, like even these little soft natural palettes, you don't have to think. You, you literally don't have to think. You just, you just do, you know? That makes it really really nice yay Shelby you should drop your posh one like it, sh it normally it's like at the bottom part of my description Becca oh Stacy you're so awesome thank you yes guys don't forget to hit that like feel free to share it over on Facebook and we will grow our family over here I get okay Tina I was getting foundation FOMO bad, bad, because you know I love my girl Tara Lynn, and she is like queen of foundation reviews, and I wasn't even wearing foundation at the time, and that's when I started going back through my stash and rediscovered, um, rediscovered this one, which now is like pretty much being discontinued, but I did pick up a few more. Um, I need to, that is, I think that's going to be one thing that I will actually do a declutter on is my foundation because honestly guys, I, um, I have too many of them and they're old. Like I haven't used MAC Cosmetics and I can't tell you how long I should do it. I could do a declutter on that. Hey Ashley. Uh -huh. 
Tia. <laughs> oh, thank you, Frog Push. I wanted the new palette and I barely used it, so I'm. Um... See, and the one thing about oh, who was I talking to? The one thing I do really like about the Biba versus the Safari. Oh my gosh, Crystal. I think it was Crystal, and I were talking about it. Um, is you do have a couple shimmers in here. And I'm one, like, I can do a matte look, but sometimes I like to put just a little bit of shimmer on my eyeball. Like, I have nothing today, but you know what I mean? Like, sometimes I like that little bit of shimmer. So, like, when it comes to, like, the Biba or, like, the Safari, which is an all matte, look, I make myself keep my Natasha Denona's here because they're expensive. This is all Maya. So she, and, and then she was talking about, um, you know, like, which one could give you more of a, 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 la, la, a variety? And I think that the Safari could totally give you a variety unless you like shimmers. And then there's that issue is like you need to have something to like be able to put shimmer in there, you know? Sorry, I tangented, missed a bunch of comments. So sorry. Have you tried the new elf? No, Angela, I haven't. Was it you? I took a screenshot. Somebody told me today to check that out. Oh, where is it? I did take it. I know I took a screen. Carol. Carol told me about that. So that elf is supposed to be a dupe for it. So yeah, I need to hunt down that palette because I do want to review that for you guys. Oh, Tina. Um, sometimes I don't wear foundation those days. When my retinol makes me peel, I just lube up and then I, I just normally do like the Wonder Beauty uh, Glotion or my, uh, where did I put it? I don't know where I put it. My Charlotte Tilbury. There it is. Are they on sale? G see, but see Gina, that's what ticks me off is they, they used to not be that much even before they used to be on sale or they used to be $49.99 and go on sale to $39.99. So that's why I got annoyed because I was like, dude, that's not cool. Like everybody's doing it. And so, you know, buying them. I bought the Savannah, but I do add shimmers. Yeah, see Gina, Jeannie, I'm the same way. Like I will normally just grab one of these and pop it in there. Norm you guys know it's normally no fun. What's normally $109.99? I missed it, sorry. I miss what that. Ah, oh, you guys, I'm failing. If you guys would check it out. Shelby does natural. She has a chance. Duh, I totally forgot to mention that. If you guys have a channel, like Stacy, who is my moderator, she has a channel. And Shelby has a channel. So, like, leave your channel name down, be down below, guys, so other people can check them out. Sorry, I'm trying to read comments. This gets so tricky. Shut up. Gina, they're $109.99 now? That's awful. No. Honestly, guys, I mean, if you're going to pay that, I would say probably the Ikea ones are the same price, right? She lost 33 pounds, Stacy. That's awesome. Oh, wait. Is that me? Me? I did. <laughs> so confused with my life. <laughs> Oh, God bless you guys for watching this train wreck. Huh. Uh, that's insane. It's not worth it, Gina. I'll tell you guys that right now. You only get five of these drawers, and I don't think they're worth it. Oh, okay, Stacey. I was like, me? Yes, I did. What I do with my singles, put them all in one palette. You, okay, Rachel. Hey, Rachel. So does that mean you like depot them? Because I've got one of these. I've got one of these. These are like the Chrysanna Ann. I love these too. Um, I forget to use them when they're in this. I mean, I keep it down here because they're good shadows. Oh, Angela, yes. Cindy Grace. I have her Tropic Dupe Shadows. They are amazing. They are so creamy. 
They're just so creamy. Like, you could use that as a highlighter. It's so pretty. Tangent it. Thank you, Stacy. Because <laughs> I'm a mess. Okay, so see, Christine, if the Ikea drawers, you get five of them for 90 bucks. I mean, like, that's where I'm like, hmm, 54 would be better, but I just don't like how Michael's raised their price because everybody was going for them, you know? I've not tried, I've only tried these kind, Angela, like these, and they're really good. I mean, they're so nice and soft, and they last. Uh-oh. I just dropped one. Hold on. Ooh. I think that was one I got in like Ipsy or something, a single. I've got to try the cream ones that you're talking about, Angela. I don't know those ones. I've never tried that kind. I've just tried those and they're really nice. They're really, really nice. So, did any of you guys go to the Sephora holiday event by chance? Did you guys pick anything up? Because I didn't pick up anything that was holiday related. Just things that I needed. I haven't heard of some of these brands. I'm going to get my central option. <laughs> just get one. Fall in love. Yes. I need more water. I'm like sweating. Lives make me so nervous, guys, because I don't want to upset anybody by missing comments. And I know that there was like a flood of comments, and I missed. And I'm sorry. Mm. Did you guys know that Sephora has their own credit card? Like, what? You got here at 9.59. <laughs> I was... You didn't miss out, Catherine. At least if you went to the one out in like Crestview Hills. I was like, ugh. The only thing I want in here is Sephora's day two Is that, Angela's the hydration one? Because I tried the other one. And I tried that one when my skin was oily too. And it looked god awful. I mean, I aged with that one, I swear. Did you, Gina? That one looks fun. I ended up not getting it because I was getting the Pat McGrath one. And I'm like, mm. so I, it, I probably, I don't know. It was, it's really pretty. Oh, good idea, Stacy. Yes, if you guys have your own YouTube channel, put a heart. Because I think that the, if you leave links, I want to say it gets dumped into spam. I could be wrong on that, but I feel like it does. So leave a heart and then people can look at your little icon and click and get to your channel. You're so smart, Stacey. See, this is why I need you to help me out here. You know what, Christine? I think the Tatcha and the Drunk Elephant, I think that was a good set. That that definitely was a really good set there. So like, I Haley said she saw some sort of Drunk Elephant thing. I did not. Oh, Jen, you're still here. Yeah, Jen Gerard has a channel, you guys. She donates her money that she earns on YouTube to charity. So you definitely want to go check her out. Definitely go check her out. Holly, yes, I, it was funny because right before I started my YouTube channel, um, Haley, my daughter, got me into BH Cosmetics. And I used to use those all the time and then I started finding other brands and other brands and huh, then I just got crazy. I think the Drunk Elephant set was a good one, too. I like that the one I... I did not see the holiday one, so I don't know if that's what Haley saw or if she just saw, like, the little mini standard one that they had. Because I saw the holiday one had the de bronzy in there, and I love that de bronzy. Neutrogena Gel Base Fragrance Hydro Boost. Ooh, I've not tried that, Angela. Natasha Mini Gold... I was so bummed, Stephanie, that's what, one of the things that I was hopeful that the Sephora would have, like, the manager was like, that's not released yet, and I'm like, it's a holiday event, like, I thought we were going to get to, like, sneaky peeky things, <laughs> and she's like, nah, I'm like, sorry, sis, but yeah, I wanted to at least see it and feel it and everything, I'm not going to get it, like, I don't have any of the mini ones, and I feel like, since I have the regular gold palette, like, I probably don't need the mini. 
but I still wanted to see it and I wanted to see that um, highlighter set thingy. There's different things a drunk elephant that I like, Stephanie. Like the C Firma stuff does not work with my skin at all. Um, I like the Debronzy. That is, I'm trying to, I'm, yeah, that's all I use in my skincare for drunk elephant is Debronzy. I used to use all of it. And then um, I started like switching it up with different stuff. Hey, Crystal, I was just talking about you. Um, how we were talking about the. The Savannah and the Golden, the only like the Natasha Denona. Why am I drawing a blank? Safari and and uh, Gold Palette. Oh, girl. Lord Jesus, nerves get the best of me. Thyroid dead on arrival. Oh, girl, I feel you, Angela. I feel you. How did I say that? Is it Osier? I'm so bad. 1955. I got that. I mean, holy moly, that has been a game changer. That's awesome. I've not tried any of the um, Tarte skincare, have I? No, I think I tried their um, Weezer. Oh, okay, I can I can do that. Um, primer. There was a mini primer. I think it's in the drawer now. I think I will have to hunt for it later. Just leave a heart, Tia. Are you talking about Tia to your channel? Tia has a channel. You can leave a heart and people can click your icon. See how Jen is leaving a heart, y'all? Go over to her channel. Because like I said, her channel is for charity. And she helps the local shelters for puppies. We love that. Good affordable skincare routine. Anybody have any good recommendations? You know, I used to use Neutrogena and Rock. I don't know how the ingredients are, but like in my like late 20s, 30s, that's what I used. And then I used that Rodan and Fields for a while, and then Sunday Riley and Drunk Elephant, and now I uh, use the Wonder Beauty um, SkinCeuticals and Drunk Elephant. Oh, Tia Marie, I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, okay. When I hop off here and fill out my description box, which it'll just be like, um, I'll, I'll cut and paste it in there for you. It is, Angela. See, now I would trust um, Neutrogena. Like, I'm trying to think. I used to use, I'm trying to think what I used to use. They had like a skincare line and my mom used Neutrogena and Oil Valet, I think it was. Um, when I was a kid, I remember seeing that, so I would use hers. <laughs> so that's what I used. Elemis is my favorite skincare. Oh, oh, let's talk real quick. Uh, I was playing around on Alta, and then I came across this. You guys, I'm so sorry if I have nuts in my teeth. I do care line. Have you guys heard of this? Because they have a berry melting makeup remover balm. And this I Do Care Mini Scoops Wash Off Mask Set and a Glow Easy Vitamin C Lip Oil that I was curious about. I was really curious. So I was like, oh, I need to ask you guys if you've tried this or heard of this company before. Glow Recipe has Afterpay, so I use that. I'm extremely oily. Have you tried um, Retinol, Christine? Because that's what helped really control my oils, I think is like the the retinol you've not heard of it jen i i had neither i had not either but i was like going through the for sale section and sometimes i feel like if it's for sale like on sale you know i'm using for hydrobotic oh crystal i like that i i use that um the Dr. Brandt thing, that's what you're talking about, right? In BoxyCharm? I I use my skincare and then I pack it right on top of all my skincare because I feel like it just kind of seals the deal there. And I like it and it doesn't break me out and it helps like moisturize my skin. I do like that Dr. Brandt that we got in BoxyCharm. See, I would say if you're looking for skincare, and I'm going to just apologize now, guys, because my dingbat butt did not think to talk about that when I filmed my routine video for what I do in the morning. But 
I mean, I didn't have a problem with like the Neutrogena. I just need, I got to a point where I just plateaued, you know, and I needed something else to boost my skin. And then I just kind of started like working my way up. And then I got on the SkinCeuticals because that's what my esthetician lady started talking about. Shelby said the organ, the ordinary 2% retinol, I've not tried it. I've, I've not tried that one, but you know, and that's really affordable too, guys. Sorry, let me go back. Yes, do what um, Flawed and Fla Fabulous, Stacy. she has a channel. She's leaving hearts. We got Jen, uh, Shelby. You guys leave a heart so people can go check out your channel. Gabrielle, oh, I missed it. I missed it. I'm missing people's comments. I'm so sorry, guys. Look, your girl's queen of ADHD, and she, she doesn't uh, read quickly, so. Mm. The good mono molecules from... I, why have I heard of that? Angela, I've heard of it, but I don't know it. Yes, my retinol, I, I get from Curology, and then I get a really strong one from my doctor, like Jenny does. Am I saying it right, Jenny or Jeannie? Jenny? Mm, I'm so sorry. Makeup Enthusiast, she has a channel. If you guys see a heart in the replay, if you are here on a replay, hit that like button, feel free, you can still share this. But if you guys see keep seeing heart emojis popping up, y'all, those people have channels. So go over and check out their channels. And because we're all about community over competition over here, a little peace and happiness. Even those people that come in here and thumbs down me, whatever. No salty, not salty, no shade, whatever. You do you boo. Oh god, sassy pants are engaged, guys. Watch out. This girl should probably jump off. <laughs> Yes, Dr. Drake. Is she the one that goes into the dollar store and tells you guys not, what not to touch? Right? Am I thinking of the same person? Lisa, hi. I also like meaningful beauty. Y'all, if I could look like Cindy Crawford at 50, 60 some years, she's 50 something, right? Then I might consider using that stuff. That's pretty amazing. Ordinary, but I haven't found anyone. I had gotten the salicylic acid crystal from the ordinary really ex inexpensive like really inexpensive and um i use that on like my kids and when i used to break out because i used to get cystic acne really bad so um i don't know thumbs down if you don't like the channel video then don't watch amen sis <laughs> No, it's funny, like, now, like, I used to get so butthurt about it, I'm not even gonna lie, like, let's be real, and I would be sitting there, like, oh my gosh, 20 minutes in, why the frick do I get a thumbs down, like, what the heck, people, and then there's always someone who, like, comes on and, like, makes fun of, like, either the way I talk, or the fact that I talk all over the place, and I'm just like, hi, did you read the name of the channel? It's called Hot Mess Mama for a reason, <laughs> because... Back in the day, Haley and I used to go live on this Facebook group that was all about makeup. And I literally had, like, I was called Hot Mess Mama because I was, I would come back from dropping my kids off from school. I was trying to hurry up and get ready from work or for work. And I was always in my PJs, my hair, like, literally all over the place. And all you saw was, like, a coffee mug in my hand. And I was, like, the epitome of a hot mess mom like you know the cutesy little moms that go through parent drop-off and like they completely have their shiznits together <laughs> I've never been that mom I'm the mom that comes in on two wheels we still have time the kids aren't rushing to their classes but I am on like you know I, I'm just that mom so that's where I've gotten yeah <laughs> so when they come in and dislike me for my rambles I'm like oh sis like, come on now. <laughs> like, I, I just keep it real. Like, this is what you get. I could totally get on here and be like, hey, everybody. Welcome to my channel. Today, we're going to talk about the Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter. Like, I can't even do it. I fumble over crap. <laughs> like, I just keep it real. Like, I just want everybody to know it's okay to just be a hot freaking mess whether you're a mom or not, you know, because I was a hot mess even before kids. It's just in my genes, you know. Oh, I missed stuff, sorry. You go long enough, the trolls emerge. You're right. You're right, Angela. And it doesn't even take that long. 
I don't know. I'm like, well, I get it. I'm not everyone's cup of tea. But I think what I struggled with the most is because I, I think it was just because I have the anxiety and depression, which is so much better, you know. But, like, I had a lot going on when I started my YouTube channel. Like, legit, guys, my YouTube channel, I started not only because, like, there's not many people out there my age doing YouTube, but... It was like my escape from my sh struggles, you know? It was like I could just get on here, talk about something that I truly loved, and it, like, helped so much with my anxiety and depression. And, like, everybody has their own insecurities. Like, let's be real. Everybody has their own insecurities and things that they're uncomfortable with on themselves. So then when people get on, you know, keyboardwarrior.com and start coming for you, you're like... Yeah, I already know that about me. Thanks. Cool. Bye. You know? I rambled again. Thanks. Holy crap! Someone just gave me... Aww. I don't know who did that, and I don't even know how you did that, but thank you so much. Someone just gave me money. I so appreciate that. Mwah! I just wanted to get on and ramble, because that's what I do. <laughs> Hot mess is one of my favorite phrases. Amen, Tina. <laughs> I just started on Good Molecules. Oh, yeah, because you guys asked about that. I'm so sorry. I'm all over. Marie, thank you so much. I'm scrolling back. Marie, oh, you're just so sweet. Thank you. You so didn't have to do that. I truly appreciate that. I was bad today as far as buying, y'all. Bought three of, three of the sale items from Ulta. Got Bartlett and Bloom Palette and the Too Faced Primer setting. You know what though? Okay, this is horrible of me, Crystal. I know we're trying to be like makeup therapy intervention, but I hear very, very good things about the primer and setting spray. I do. Didn't work so much for me when I had oily skin. It probably would work now. I don't have the Tartlet and Bloom palette. I got, hold on. I don't, where is it? Oh, oh what is this? Here it is. See, I'm organized. It's just not always pretty. You know what I'm saying? So I have this one that my daughter got me. And I... You, oh, I just got them there. I, um... Oh, it still smells. She got it for me for Mother's Day. And I love this. And I used it. Like, look at y'all. I think this is, like, the only palette that I've used so much that you can't read Tarte in a majority of the shades. Like, I'm so proud of myself for that. <laughs> oh, let me go... Oh, Christine, thank you guys so much. Oh, I so appreciate y'all's support. Thank you. I enjoy the... Oh, you see? Because there's just, there's really not. There's, like, Jen is on here. And she has, she has um, her own channel. Because, like I said, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a quick repeat, guys. If you guys have a channel, leave a heart down below. Flawed and Fabulous is on here. Look, I say it's fabulous, not fabulous. That's how I talk outside of... Sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm turning red. But if you have a channel, leave a heart emoji. And y'all that are coming back in for the replay, after you've hit that like button, then go check out um, People with Hearts. Oh, here come some children. Can I help you, sir? No. Oh, okay. Hi. <laughs> Kids. <laughs> <laughs> Tia Marie, she has a channel. Shelby, sorry, I'm trying to, there we go, Shelby. Thank you, Carla, because it, it definitely is one of those things where I'm like, I try not to ramble, and then it just, I open my mouth, and it just, <laughs> more women over 40, yes. Oh, that's what I started to say, Jen, over 40. So, yeah, check everybody's channel out, guys. Oh, Marie, you're going to love it, a setting spray. You're going to love it. I've got, like, my whole collection. Hold on. Where did I put my... Oh, did you fall? No, you're right here in front of my face. Boom. I Really, Stacy? Why did I... We totally even talked about that. I didn't think you were 40 just yet. I thought you were the baby. See? This is the mint chocolate chip. Can you tell? This is my favorite um, ice cream. By the way, if you are keto, Rebel ice cream will rock your socks off. It's amazing. Just saying. 
I'm so excited. We have like a good amount of people. You guys are rocking it. Look at that with your thumbs up. Thank you guys. Yeah, I know. You've told me this, Daisy, but I'm like, no, no. I don't, I don't buy it. <laughs> Isn't it delicious, Gina? I love it. Like every time, this one and the, well, I mean, I have the orange dreamsicle one and I love that one too. But I have, Rachel, I love you too. You're such a sweetheart. Rachel's one of, well, can I, Rachel, I was gonna, I'm like, I'm just saying everybody's name. Sorry. She's one of my Patreons. She's, I think you were my first Patreon, actually. Oh, you're the sweetest. Thank you guys so much. Oh my gosh. Okay, get this, Shelby. So, I know, right, Stacy? So, they actually are now selling it at Kroger's. I don't know if y'all have Kroger's in your neck of the woods, but we have Kroger's. I know, like, down south, there's, like, Publix which is expensive, um, but Kroger's is now selling it. And it's funny because, oh, who was I talking to? Somebody left a message saying, and I never caught it right away, but it the, the new one has um, the whole pint, four carbs. It used to be six, so I guess they reformulated it. It's delicious. And um, Publix sells it. Awesome, there you go. So Shelby, you can get it at Kroger's, and at Publix, depending, oh, you're in Indiana. Okay, so there you go. But I was always ordering mine from Rebel Creamery, and they, I don't know how many flavors that um, Kroger's has. Oh, and your health food store normally has them, too. We went to Publix, when, where were we? In Florida, was it Florida? Florida, yeah. And I was shocked. I am like the weirdo that, look, I like struggle with so much stuff, but like the useless knowledge that you don't need to like save in your head, that, this girl. So we're walking through Publix and I'm like, holy crap, that's only $4.99 at home at Kroger's. And I was like, this place is expensive. So I was like messaging um, Amanda, Keto Ginger, and I'm like, your Publix is expensive down here. Like, how do you survive? <laughs> this is crazy. Kroger is Smith's on the West Coast. No, I did not know that. I've never heard of Smith's before. That's cool. Oh, I'm missing stuff. I'm missing stuff. It's really good, though, guys. I'm telling you. Like, that, if you struggle and need desserts, it's really good. It's like, it's, but it's like if you, I don't know, do you guys have graters in your neck of the woods? We have what's called graters. It was sent from heaven above. And it made me miss ice cream so much. But then I found the rubble and I, I'm much better about it. Much, much better. Oh. <laughs> See, and I know, like, that's the thing, Rachel. Like, I know, you, and, and even Stacy. Like, I just, I know you guys' screen names, but I call you your name name. And I'm like, people are probably like, who is this Stacy and Rachel she keeps talking about? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Hold on, I found another Pat McGrath doohickey. Like I told you guys, I opened that box up like a monster. Christine, I have to say, like when I started YouTube, that was my biggest thing. I was watching all the younger, which obviously there's nothing wrong with them. They're, they're amazing at makeup too. But I was taking all of their techniques, and I mean, Y'all, even a year ago, if you go back and look at my videos, I was taking all their techniques and I was trying to apply my concealer that way. And I was putting powder, uh, like so much powder up under my eyes. And it just aged my skin so much. Like when you look back after I put on a full face, I'm like, it was Monet. And it could have been the fact that I was using an extremely old camera, you know? But the only one tip that... I would still use today if I was still oily is Jackie Ina would take powder after she primed before she put on her foundation and that was a tip that really 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 worked well for my oily skin but the layering up under the eyes all the powder the baking and all of that for this girl she's I'm 41 that was just too much couldn't do it you know <laughs> I know. 
And I've been with you, Miss Stacy, through a couple different names. <laughs> exactly. Is it ooh, ooh, sure. Weezy? Weezy? Weezer? Weezy? Maybe? Ah. We don't. We don't. And it's funny, though, because... Like, for me, I would watch the videos of everybody using all of that, and I would think, oh, that's what I need, you know? But, and it's crazy, Tina. You're right. It totally is different. Like, my skin's different than what it was last year when I was 40. And you know what I mean? It's just the way how things, like, change. It's, I don't know. It's just crazy to me. I saw those today, um, Angela, because I do a click list. Okay, so I feel horrible because I know Finding Life was asking about, like, meeting up for, like, desserts and stuff. Y'all, I'm so anxiety-ridden that I legitimately do grocery pickup because of, like, I, I, like, how did I work in the real world? I don't know. Somehow I did it. <laughs> I think probably why I was stressed all the time. But, like, I just do Kroger pickup. And when I was making my list, um, I saw those Halo, and I was like, ooh, I'm kind of curious about those. I use my cell phone to do the video. Oh, there. Carla has a channel, too, guys. To see her heart, she's got a channel. And she unboxed the Rich Lux Gerard Cosmetics. Yay! We love it so much. <laughs> Get back to studying. Oh, thank you, Holly. I know. I need to jump on. I'm like, I tell myself, you're not going to ramble longer than 45 minutes. Here we are, well over an hour. Sorry. <laughs> oh, that's awesome, Christine. That's awesome. Okay, guys, I should probably jump off too because my little one came in. I didn't even, I didn't get to chat with anybody. So I'm going to hop off here. But I want, thank you, Holly. I want to thank you guys so much for getting on here and talk. And if I missed your comments, you guys, I am so, 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 so sorry. I'm a slow reader. Um, but I will try and get back through there. But every Sunday, 6.15 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Oh, you've never been here. Thank you, Angela, for stopping by. I need to take a break. How rude. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> right? They're like, you really want to listen to this girl ramble on for another 15 minutes? Like, come on now. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so, so much for joining me. Thank you to those of you who gave money. I appreciate you guys so, so much. Yes, hit that like button. Feel free to share. You, Rachel, seriously? She didn't get notified. See? Okay, guys, 6.15 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every Sunday. Your girl's going to be here for a hot mess ramble. <laughs> All right, guys, I will see you tomorrow. I've been playing around with my time, so it'll go up anywhere after 3.45 tomorrow. Anyways, guys, I love you guys so much. Thank you again for joining me. Thank you guys to those of you who sent a donation. I greatly appreciate it. I love you guys so much, and I will catch you tomorrow. Mwah! Kiss from Kentucky.